birds food and more different birds eat different kinds of food birds eat grains fruits seeds insects fish and other small animals birds have beaks and claws to catch hold and eat their food birds eat with the help of their beaks they do not have teeth therefore they eat their whole food sometimes they use their beak to either break or tear food into small pieces before swallowing it shape of the beak depends on the kind of the food they eat different kinds of beaks some birds have short hard and pointed beak to pick up seeds and worms for example sparrow pigeon and peacock some birds have strong and curved beak to crack open fruits and nuts for example parakeets some have short and broad beak and sticky on the inside to catch insects strong and pointed beak acts like a chisel to remove bark and find insects hiding inside such as woodpecker woodpecker have this type of beak it has very long tongue which is sticky at the tip for catching insects some birds have long thick and pointed beak to suck nectar from the flower for example hummingbird some birds have long thin and slightly curved beak to pull out insects from holes in the ground for example hoop some birds have broad and flat beaks with tiny holes at the side to scoop muddy water along with what plants and insects This muddy water flows out through the holes leaving plants and insects inside For example duck and swans have this kind of beak Some birds have long broad and pointed beaks to eat fish from water For example, kingfisher is having this kind of beak. Some birds have strong and sharp hooked kind of beak to tear the flesh. For example, eagles, hawks, kites, vultures, etc. They have this kind of beaks. feet and claws different kinds of birds have different kinds of feet and claws depending on how and where they live they use their feet and claws to catch and hold their food they also use them to fight and to move perching birds perching birds have three toes in front and one at the back They use these to hold on to the branch of a tree. The grip is so strong that they do not fall off even when they are sleeping on the branch. For example, sparrows and crow. Scratching birds. Scratching birds has strong legs with three toes in front and one at the back. 
the toe have sharp hard claw to dig the ground for example hen hen scratch the ground for seeds and worms woodpecker have two sharp clawed toes pointing in front and two at the back it helps them to grab the sides of trees and balance while they peck the wood flesh eating birds these birds uses their feet to capture their prey they have they have curved and sharp claws it is called talons they use their talons to capture their prey for example eagles hawks etc swimming birds birds like ducks have webbed feet they have three toes in front and one at the back front toes are joined by flaps of skin called web webbed feet are used like paddles to push back water while swimming wading birds birds like cranes flamingos herons etc have long and thin legs with long thin and spread out toes when they wade in the water their legs do not sink into the soft mud ostrich is a flightless bird it has strong legs and sharp claws to rocket itself from its enemies it uses its strong legs to walk and run how birds fly birds have small light and fluffy feathers which cover their body and keep them warm these feathers are called stiff flight feather are on the wings and on the tail which helps the bird to fly birds shed their feathers from time to time and new feathers grow in their place birds have two wings which help them to fly wings have flight feathers and are attached to the body with the strong muscles these muscles are used to flap the wings body of the bird is shaped like a bow their bones are hollow and light the tail helps with the speed and direction their feathers of a bird help it to fly easily birds flap their wings up and down to fly upward movement of wings is known as upstroke while the downward movement is known as downstroke sparrows and hummingbirds flap their wings glide in the sky they have strong wings and do not flap them often ostrich and the kiwi cannot fly at all nesting habits birds build nests they either build on the ground or on the trees and bushes nests are made of dry grasses and twigs mud is also used quite often to make nests soft things like moss feathers wool or grass are used for lining the nest from inside birds build different kinds of nests the tailor bird uses its beak like a needle to sew large leaves together with the plant fiber to form a nest each stitch is tied in a knot the weaver bird weaves a nest of a grass in a tree The nest is made soft from inside with the help of feathers. It looks like a bottle hanging up upside down. 
The bird enters its home through a tunnel-like opening at the bottom of the nest.